Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we're playing some Raid Shadow Legends. This should be episode 32, I think. Uh, so without any further ado, let's go right into it. By the way, I have a Discord server. I have a giveaway ongoing if you want to check that video. I have a clan if you're dealing a lot to uh, clan boss. Join my Discord server and get in contact with me and we'll make it work. But uh, yeah, I'm in the middle of a battle right now. Because I figured, as you can see by the title, I want to make it to gold 4. I don't know if it's easily doable. I think it should be doable very quickly, which is kind of why I started the recording because I wanted to, to do that. Uh, and yeah, my Atel has become even stronger right now. I've, I've upgraded things. I've gotten a lot of relics. So I do have a lot of things I want to showcase to you guys as well. So we have a lot of things to, to do and I want to show you guys the masteries I've done on Ray. Like I've done a lot of things, but before we do that, I think it's time that we just like go for frick and gold for because why not then my gear then my stats will look even better when i show them to you guys so let's just uh, do that and hopefully these guys will have a lot of uh, less attack and all that hopefully i will just one shot all of them i killed a lot of them not the relic keeper though i took out the what's his name the soul drinker and now the relic keeper should go down and i should be gold for technically i'll be gold for heck yeah man Gold 4 has been achieved. We're now at, at gold 4. This is amazing. I'll just do this just so that I can stay at gold 4 during the entire video. Because I'm sure someone will knock me down easily. So I'll take down this uh, YouTube personality person. And we will just do acid rain. Like even auto knows what to do sometimes. Like a 5 second battle, that's not bad at all. 80 tournament points per. And we have 50 minutes remaining of that. Yeah, I... <laughs> I, I need to I need to show you guys the stats. I've just gotten a little bit addicted to doing this right now. This will be the final one. Then I'll show you guys the relics. And then we can potentially continue afterwards. But I do want to show you what I've done. I've spent nearly 1600 stamina in the spider dungeon. And I've gotten some, some stuff. Why the heck... Why is gold 4 so easy? What's the, what the hell, man? What the heck? Okay, anyway, I'll, I'll show you. Yeah, 44 minutes left on, of the tournament. So, there's not a lot of time remaining there and I won't be able to complete it. I should have grinded it more, but I've been working. And uh, yeah, basically that's my excuse. So, what have I gotten you for this guy? I, I, I have gotten this one. I could increase the speed by doing that, but I'd lose a lot of other things. But And I'd lose a lot of accuracy. And I, I, I want to keep the accuracy because that really improves this... Uh, if I, if I remove the accuracy, that's that's the worst thing I could possibly do. The accuracy is too important. And then I, I have an attack one here, which I could replace. Uh, but this also gives accuracy, which is kind of making me want to just keep it. I may want to do this, but then again, it gives him crit damage. So I'm like, is this worth changing? But it may be, it may be, because it may give him even more accuracy at that point. So I may change those. Uh, when it comes to the ring, I do have an attack ring on him. I think I should have a better one now. Yeah, I have, I have um, I have one of these. But the thing is, the attack ring gives sixteen percent health, so I'd lose I'd lose a lot of health. And there is he he got a perfect attack ring as well. Then we are heading over to Gorgorab, which I did put a flag on today. I got a resistance uh, flag, which I got so lucky with. Look at this, two times speed uh, on repeat. This is great. I got 10 speed from this, uh, well, flag or banner, whatever you want to call it. So this is a very good one. It gives him resistance. I think that just makes him have a lesser chance of being, like, decreased, de decreased defense debuffed, which is also not bad. So overall, he's got a pretty good resistance, and he has even 10 more speed right now. So now he's currently sitting at 220 speed, which isn't bad at all, plus the, bu plus the aura buff. And then I have uh, this one. I haven't done anything with it, and I have this one. I do think that I have... Uh, yeah, I guess I have this ring right here if I really wanted to just try another one, but I don't see the point. Well, I could get more HP from this. Uh, so I may want to work on it. Hopefully, maybe I could get, like... Yeah, I, I could get some, I, some stuff. And then we have a necklace, which gives me 25 accuracy. This guy doesn't de give debuffs. Uh, but I'd, I'd rather want HP than defense, I think. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I want to use this necklace or not. You guys should let me know about it. It's It would be worth a lot if I wanted to sell it, so... Uh, and then I had this one I tried for speed, and I was unlucky, so I ended up not doing it. It may be good for someone else, though, with, um, with the additional attack buff. Then we're going to head over to my... Kale. 
I, I'm working on this one. Uh, I'm not going to replace my kales, of course. My kale... I don't know, maybe I will. It depends, it depends on what substats this goes uh, gets. How, but I wanted to place that, I wanted to put that ring on Ray whenever I whenever I have the chance, but I can't at the moment, it, it would just give her less stats. Then I have of course a crit damage amulet. Uh, I don't think I have any other crit damage amulets, I have some HP. Well this one gives 5% crit damage, but none of them really works a lot. I guess the accuracy amulet here would be actually kind of useful for her. But hers give crit damage, so probably not. Uh, I need I need all the crit damage I can possibly get because it's a very powerful buff. Well, this isn't bad. What does he, he get? He gets 18 accuracy, okay. I guess I, I may have found a replacement for her then. Because this right here gives accuracy and crit damage, which would be a very little combo. Give it, yeah, I may, I may wanna, okay, so I'll just, uh, wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. Uh, where is it? It's this one. I want to level it up once just so that I can keep track of it. Uh, there we go. And then I have, uh, let's see here, anyone else which was good? I have some flags. Uh, I have like a defense with speed, resistance and attack flag. I think I'll use the attack flag on her. Just, oh man. If she did, if, if neither um, Ray or Kale didn't use, like this is so perfect for attack. But it's, it doesn't outshine the accuracy, it really doesn't. I may want to do it purely for PvE, purely for campaign grinding. I think this could be a very good flag for campaign grinding, because... Yeah, 338 plus even more from here. So I think this will be a very good campaign flag. I or... Banner, I'm sorry for calling it a flag. It's, it's a banner. But yeah, I think that would be a very good thing. And then we have uh, Atol. Which I got a better flag, a banner, uh, which essentially just gave her more attack and HP. I even changed her ring uh, from this one. She 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 lost twenty attack, but it's okay. She she gained she gained more she gained more defense. She gained more health. No wait, she lost she lost she only gained more health basically. But look at this ring though. It gives twenty percent attack, which isn't bad at all. So I I don't regret going down twenty attack for getting all of this HP because her HP right now. Has gotten better, her attack is the highest attack I have on anyone in my team, and her crit damage I need to improve a lot. The downside is I don't have any amulets giving, uh, just giving that. I need, I need a crit damage amulet. I, I know I have one here giving some crit damage, but yeah, it's, yeah, it doesn't matter. Like, I, I just need, it gives a lot of attack though. But I need a crit damage amulet, that's what I need for her. And then we have our uh, apothecary with just some stuff I haven't really done much with. Defense and attack and speed. So yeah, I'll have to upgrade those, but at the moment I haven't. Also, I could use like um, like a HP one. I guess I don't have any. Well, that, that's, that's, uh, that's basically it. I think that's all I had on these heroes. Uh, and another thing, I guess uh, I'm, I'm nearly done on uh, race uh, masteries already. I just need her to be 6 stars and I need like 30 scrolls, which is like just a couple of battles, 3 battles or something. Then I will go for Warmaster Mastery on her. I also changed all of my Masteries, uh, because uh, I, I followed Reddit and followed uh, Pirate Lurker and uh, just a guy. So this is the setup for Tomb Lord. This is a Gore Grab, I haven't changed anything on, so he's, he's basically the same. Then I have changed uh, to Crit Rate on Mikhail, so this is how he looks. And then my Atel Masteries has, has this, basically, I don't care much about her, I, I don't want to reset her Masteries at the moment. Because she will be replaced by Ray anyway, so there's no point. And then, uh, then I have her, and I haven't done any Masteries on Asana yet, but I want to do that at some point. I just, I just, now I need to grind for crit rate attack gauntlets. Uh, I need to grind for those. Another thing though, which, which is important to note before I continue with PvP. Is that I do have, I do currently have uh, 101 per 103% crit rate on this on this uh, hero right here. So I I first of all I want to go full attack. I want to go full attack set, and then I may want to just get attack five star attack gauntlets, and hopefully with that I will be able to one shot everyone in campaign so that she is faster to grind fodder than my Kale. Even at level 50, I think she could be faster if she one-shotted everyone. But unfortunately, she doesn't do that. And yeah, that, that's that's what I need. And I do want better boots as well. 
I may want to just go for crit, hmm, crit damage. I don't know. Anyway, that's just something something I was thinking about just doing. So let's let's continue a little bit with Arena at my gold four rank. Just grinding up gold four seems rather easy so far. I don't know why that is, but uh, I suppose I won't complain. Like it's not it's not bad. It's not bad. I'll take it. I'll take all the easy battles, man. All the champion arena points. I don't think I could reach 8,000 points or 10,000 points before it's over. Maybe if it continues wins, but what are the chances of that? Also, that's a tanky boy. I know who is that? I guess he's a red boy. Who see he's a rowbar. He seems tanky. Uh fight in the arena five times. Yeah, man. I'll claim all the stamina. Weekly quests have reset as well. Uh so I will get much more much more stamina with just ascending one person there as well. Which isn't too bad. Uh, so currently, this is my this is my setup. I'm I'm doing better. Gorgorab is quick as heck with 220 speed. It's kind of ridiculous the speed, man. Gorgorab's speed, it's just amazing. His 220 speed, I feel happy about it. I know people are have like 250, but let me be happy about uh, 220 because someone told me. Yeah, I should, I should work on his gear until he gets a plus 120 from gear. And now he does that. Which makes me, makes me like, yeah, man, I, I did something correctly. I did something right. And then I just took out the apothecary easily like that. This is easy tournament point grinding. Holy crap. Hopefully it's continuously this easy. Because like everyone here is easy. I don't know why. I should have I should have done this yesterday. I should have grinded a lot. I Do I have all the arena attempts still? I need to take a look at something because I may be able to just do Arena 24-7 before it ends. Uh, before the tournament ends. So, uh, do I do I still have that? Let's take a look here. Yeah, I do. And they expire in 5 hours. Yeah, I did, I did a purchase, uh, of course, because that's sometimes something I do. Let's just continue, man. I don't mind. Gold 4 is easy, man. Just let me be at Gold 4. I don't mind. It's good. My stats, they're good. <laughs> The, 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 well, they're, my stats... What? The, how do I say that? My stats is good towards these enemies. I don't think they're good towards, like, late gold four, but currently I'm getting a lot. Getting a lot of gold medals, getting a lot of very easy wins. Like, these wins right here, it's so easy. This is, this is like, just... This is, this is fantastic. I'm very happy about it. I'm very happy about how this is going right now. But I have a feeling once it refreshes, I'll be screwed and I'll be sad and I'll have to end the video because I will get zero wins. But we can, we can do all the tournament points we want, uh, we can at least so far. Because, yeah, okay, sure, sure, I do, I do have. Uh, let's see here. Which one is expiring the fir first, uh, first of them? Let's just do that one. Then we'll continue with the arena. I can even purposefully lose because I have so many attempts. Uh, uh, that is, is if I want to try and go for the sacred shard, but at least what I really want is the legendary skill book. If I can get that, I'll be very happy. Also, there's a dungeon divers event, which is ongoing, which I won't, I, I don't, I, I want to do it. I really want to do it, but I won't, because the, my next focus right now is to simply foc, my, my next focus is campaign. I need to grind food. My next focus is basically six array. That's my next main focus. I'm done with relics for now. Uh, I will try and level up that banner, even though that won't do anything for her. But it may it may help my Kale a lot to just kill those guys even quicker. But I don't I don't think it matters because he doesn't have full AOE skills. I could also try and put his gear over to my uh, over to my to my ray because I, I genuinely believe that uh, if properly built. Uh, with proper gear, she can one-shot all of them, even at 5 stars. So, hopefully the game doesn't just lag out. Uh, the game is currently experiencing issues. Please just work, for, for love of everything. I don't want the game to have server issues right now, thank goodness. Yeah, I've I've been very lucky. I haven't had any server issues. Ma ma I haven't had any major server issues uh, while while playing, uh, while, while recording. Because that's very co the server downtime is very common. Unfortunately, but I guess they're fixing it. So yeah, what can we what can you do? Let's just uh, simply do that then take her out 15 second battle Please don't mess up. Thank you 12 uh, 12 ranking points. I don't mind that mm, This is, seems to become more difficult very very much so 30 30 100 Well, let's just take out Natasha anyway. She seems like she has a pretty pretty easy team to take out 
So technically, if I if I was rich and had infinite um, an infinite amount of gems, I could simply just refresh over and over and just do this one battle with a guaranteed win, just over and over again and get all the tournament points. Because that's easy, eighty tournament points. I think I should be able to take these guys out as well, though they're only seventy two k power. But then again, I've I've eaten my words before, so I may do that again today. I suppose we'll see. So let's first of all just increase my attack and boost my turn meter. Then I'll uh, decrease these guys' attack and defense, literally all of them, which is great. Hopefully the Gorgorai will die. That is my goal. Okay, he died. That's good. Let's just take this guy out. I think we're fine. I don't need to do, to do anything here. There we go. Another 80 tournament points. How many tournament points, do I, tournament points do I have currently? Can I see how much I have? I currently have... Uh, let's see here. I must scroll down. I shall scroll down. So I'm at 4,800. I need 6,000. If I could get 6,000 today within the 30 minutes, I would be happy. So that means I just need to grind over and over and over and over and over again. And will I be able to do it in 30 minutes? I hope so because I really, <laughs> I really, like, I mean, genuinely, really want to get that book to use on Ray. Like, it's very important for me to get that book. So I'll actually get that book. Hopefully it's, hopefully I'll be able to do it within the time I need. Uh, and currently I've gotten a good amount of points in, in a short amount of time. So it's possible. So that's, that's all I gotta do. I just gotta repeat, rinse and repeat all the time. And getting these four medals per round as well is very good for a great haul. Because I need a lot of them if I want to do the arena challenge for another legendary book. Which I'm going to work towards right now, actually. I, I've attack at level 4, I need it at level 5, which costs 250 gold medals. So it's definitely very grindy, but it's definitely going to be worth the legendary book whenever I get it. Again, my Gorograp has 220 speed, so he's, he's a quick boyo. And then I will decrease all their attack and defense, and then I will just almost one-shot all of them. Goodbye, Nasana. Oh, wait, no! Steelbreaker! I'll just do a normal hit on her, she will not survive. Yeah, 23k plus the War Master doing 4k. <laughs> Even though that didn't really... It wasn't really necessary to do that, but it, it happened anyway. 69k power with a Savia. I have someone in my in my clan right now with two Savias. Like, they have a pretty killer arena team right now, which is kind of cool. Uh, and yeah, they, they wanted to deal more to clan boss, so now they're getting help in my Discord. So we're listed in the, in the description if you have... A, if you have any questions, we have a um, hashtag game help chat, which you could use. Uh, hashtag is just for the code to click on the chat, but yeah, you will is easily see it. Uh, I guess I'll see if this Ray, how, how Ray does, how Ray William Johnson does. I'm curious how, how, how she does. <laughs> Feels weird saying Ray William Johnson and she, so I guess how Ray does or how he does, if it would be like Ray William Johnson. Okay, well, this is an easy victory. Goodbye. 34k. Just... My Aethel isn't bad. I'll be honest with you. My Aethel isn't bad at all. She really is good. My Aethel really is good. Also, resource arena tokens. Yeah, man, let's do it. Let's do this stuff, man. Let's do this. Let's do this short. Let's do this short. Uh, so, let's just... Let's just continue. I'll, I'll have to look afterwards. Ah, 104k power. This team may be faster than I. Because they have a higher aura. But then again, I have 220 speed on my Gorgorab. Which is like redonkulous. Okay, so these guys are pretty fast. Hopefully I will decrease... Yes, all of their attack and defense was decreased, which is great. Their Apothecary though is very powerful. Uh, very, very fast right there, my bad. Well, well, he is powerful as well, of course. Uh, but he, he was a quick boyo. But still, I think I'll win. There we go. I'm still winning at a decent phase, uh, pace right there, which isn't too bad. Just getting, just grinding up all of the gold medals I possibly can. How much more do I need for the tournament right now? We have 27 minutes remaining. I currently need... Let's see here. Where am I? I'm at 5,004, so I need 600 more points. Which means I need 8 more wins. Like 8 or 9 more wins. I think 8 wins should do it, though. Uh, how will I do against this team? Uh... Uh, I think I'll lose. I think I'll straight up lose. So there's no point. And this one as well. I think I'll simply lose. These guys are too high of a power. So let's take out the Moon Kim. Uh, because they were a YouTuber. And yeah, I don't know. Why would you want to do... <laughs> Kidding. I'm doing YouTube and it, it's cool. By the way, someone... Uh, well, I, I saw uh, Mr. Wolf's video. 
uh, on, 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 on this game and he, he showcased him on Kim. They only had two videos of this game. Like they barely, I think they had two videos of this game only and they got their YouTube title. I think they may just be a YouTuber which advertised for them and they were partnered or something. I don't know, but it was kind of funny to see the real, the, the, the YouTube accounts of the so, so-called YouTubers in this game, which was kind of, which was kind of funny. Uh, so let's just do that, decrease attack on everyone, and hopefully this will take most of them out. 55k hit, and this guy is still alive. Sir Nicholas is so tanky, man. He has over 55,000 health, basically, then. But Michael is really powerful. I'm... It amazes me to this day how powerful my team really is. Because I it shouldn't be. Like, man, well, for example, Pirates. He had a pretty good kale. He only lacked some crit damage and whatnot. And he didn't... He lost uh, in a lot of campaigns. And I'm like, how do you... Like, why is, why is kale bad for you and good for me? Well, his kale was nearly as good as mine and yeah I, I don't fully know why that works how that works i think it's mainly i think it's purely because uh because of the crit damage i think my crit damage is so high that it just does good things for me i suppose okay so how many battle how many more attempts do i have right now five so i'm getting there i don't know about the rain beast man that seems difficult it's only two mm. Sure, I'll do a red. I'll face a red team. I'll face no no heroes. Two of these heroes are a big no no heroes. So hopefully I'm quicker than they are, and hopefully they will not tank. Hopefully I will decrease their defense, and they will not tank me a lot. Okay, so I decreased most of them. Their their stats here, which is very good. So let's just uh, take them out. Okay, so that one hero is insanely tanky with a lot of shield. I'll just take out rain beast. That's what I was told yesterday when uh, the rain beast just continued. To heal, to just continue to shield and heal up the up the the enemy on the side. So let's just take out Rain Beast. There we go. He's done. And then I only have one enemy remaining to focus on, which is great. They they will lose a lot of HP and they they're heavily poisoned and they should definitely lose right now. It would really surprise me if they won, but they they obviously will not. So well, they they tanked that hit pretty nicely actually. Not bad. Not bad at all, man. Okay, Kalia. Uh, Kalia is pretty cool. Um, let's see here. This is also a team I think is doable to, uh, like, beatable. I should really just use all my arena attempts. I will do that off camera though. Uh, but I, I will at least finish the tournament today. At least the legendary book. Then at the time. But I really need to use all my arena attempts I have in mail. Just to get gold medals. I think it would be very useful just to get gold medals, simply gold medals. Also, I don't know if the Atel's AoE the attack is stronger than just a heavy single hit uh, when there's only one enemy remaining. Why? Why do you have those six stars? Is w if this team team wins, it will be hilarious. If the, I I want this team to win, I hope this team beats me. I really do. <laughs> I I hope they beat me. Unfortunately, I'm mistaken. It, I won't. But it would have been so funny with those heroes that if if they beat me, I would have been like, "What am I doing wrong with my life? What I, what have I done in this game, which is wrong? Uh, how much? Okay, so I've I've been able to claim it. Great. I seriously doubt that I'll be able to make it to ten thousand points though, which is unfortunate. However, I should be able to upgrade the skill of uh, Ray of uh, Ray William Johnson. Why am I saying that? Uh, Banish ten percent. That is her seventh turn. Oh darn. I need I need her corrode to be stronger because uh, that's the one she'll needs to do the grind to farm even quicker. Uh, that's the one she doesn't one hit the enemies with when farming, I suppose. Let's just claim even more stamina. You know what? I don't I don't see why I shouldn't just do more arena. Like it, there is no point in not doing it. Uh, I I will do it until I like struggle a lot. I, I'll do it until I lose. Basically, I I do have so many arena tokens. And I do need 250 gold medals, so I figured, why not? Just just use this until the event is over, until the event is done. If I can make it that far without any issues, of course. Uh, so he will continue to heal and poison me, that's okay, it doesn't matter. Uh, she will deal some damage, which is uh, okay for her, I suppose. Let's just take her out, there we go. That one guy is very powerful, though. He is, he is a pretty powerful boy, oh, he really is. Uh, I don't care about animating right now, there's no point. Uh, I don't care about attack buff because she already does have one. Uh, stronger from Gorgrab. 
I don't have an attack path anymore for on my Kale, which is unfortunate. I guess my Gorgrab will now uh, be able to give that to me. Let's make him give me some attack. Then I will simply just use Acid Rain. Then I will simply just use that. That hero is insanely tanky. Very nice job on, on that hero right there. He's tanking a lot, man, he really is. Let's just do that. And I guess just do an ordinary hit. 16k crits, that's not bad. But yeah, he was a Lord Charizard, wasn't it? No, bad Elkazar. That's insanely nicely tanked. It's very nice. And he healed himself a lot as well. He healed everyone. That legendary sucks. I am going to lose against that team. Like this team right here. I will stand no chance. <laughs> no chance at all. Well, I'm, I basically have zero arena tokens. And I I will just wait eight minutes of nine minutes off camera. And we'll do... And I'll do it off camera, I suppose. I would like to thank everyone for watching. If you guys did enjoy, leave a like, subscribe. And... That's about it. Thanks for to Mr. Rule for shutting me out on this video. And that's about it. I don't know what else to say. Have a nice one. Join the Discord. I have shameless self-promo all the time. <laughs> okay, goodbye.